Moshi Moshi motherfuckers! It has been a while. So I'm sure a lot of you are probably wondering where the hell I have been for the past month and a half. Um, so, I am going to briefly go over, and I, I mean briefly with the TM. I'm going to brief as briefly as I can go over what the fuck has gone on in the past couple of weeks. So, um, as you know, I changed the I changed the beat league format a couple months ago. Um, you know, the 13 champions, all that. Cool, cool. That's done. That's the good news. Pretty much the only good news. <laughs> um, <laughs> so that was finished on August 2nd. Now, before that, um, you only got three videos. That is mostly because I was very wrong about thinking that I was going to be able to upload at the same time as, as like, mass beating those champions. Um, I was just straight up wrong. I, I was I knew I was gonna upload less. I did not think it was gonna be that much less because like even those three Critica videos as simple as they were were very 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 difficult for me to get out because holy fucking shit I was just mentally drained my brain was mush so after I got those those videos out I decided you know what let me just fucking focus let me focus on beating these 13 champions as quickly as possible. So I did that on August 2nd. Boom! So, you know, I, I beat these champions on August 2nd. It's like a couple of weeks ahead of schedule. I'm thinking, oh my god, I finally did it. I'm free! Finally, the despair ends! The despair didn't end. So, um, shortly after that, I'll, like, I obviously started working on Season 3. Started planning the videos out. Like, that is the one constant that hasn't really been affected by anything. Um, so that's good. So season three is going somewhat more or less on track. But on the side of that, obviously I need to upload in the meantime. So I started working on the Kane video at about the the beginning of the month. About the same week that I beat those those 13 champions. So I started working on the Kane video and I was editing it and that's when I realized I just don't fucking care about the vanilla beat league format anymore. It is so boring and stale at this point that I just don't fucking care. I'm gonna go more into detail about that later. For now, let's just let's just move on, okay? So it took me about probably about a week to, to figure that out. So then I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Let me let me put this 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 beat league shit on the side, and then I'm gonna work on a video that I have wanted to do for several years now. It's one of those ideas that have been that has been postponed because I've been too busy with other shit for the longest time. So I said, you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm gonna make this video. So I started making this video. Things were going well. Now the the shitty thing is this video requires collaboration. And unfortunately the person that I was working with simply wasn't able to um, produce anything that was up to my standard. Like it sucks, but that's just that's just the reality of things. I gave them I gave them an entire extra week on top of the time that I already gave them, um, and they just they couldn't do it. Okay, um, it, I mean it's unfortunate, but that's that's just the risk you take when you when you collaborate. Sometimes, sometimes it just it just doesn't work out. This was one of those cases. So obviously that was not according to plan. <laughs> A good chunk of my work is already done on that particular video, so all I need to do is find someone else to fill that void, and then I can I can finish it in about a week or so. The thing is, I figured, you know what? I don't want to spend all this time finding someone else, and then, and then next thing you know, they can't. They also can't do it. So I have put that video on the side, and I'm focusing on videos that I can do solo for right now. I don't want to like completely scrap that idea, because it, again, it's it's something that I've wanted to do for a couple of years now. But it has to go on the back burner for now. It sucks, but that's just that you know that. Shit happens. And then, finally, if you've been watching the news, you might be aware that Houston got hit by a fucking hurricane. Now, I want to make it clear. I am safe. My friends are safe. My family is safe. We are fine. Okay, we were very fortunate in that our particular areas were not affected nearly as badly as some of the some of the other areas. Like, if you look in the news and you look at images of the of Hurricane Harvey, you will see, like, cars submerged, buildings submerged. You will see a lot of, like, significantly worse um, damage to those other places. We were fortunate. We did not get hit nearly that badly. There, there was a little bit of damage in our area, and obviously a lot of places aren't, aren't open just yet. There's a little bit of damage on my on my patio, but I have insurance, so that is not gonna come out of my wallet. So that that's good. Because if I had to pay for that, then oh god, I'd be crying right now. Um, so basically, things are gonna go back to normal for us very very quickly. We were very, again, we were very very lucky in that regard. But obviously, hopefully, I don't have to explain that in the middle of a hurricane, I can't really do much. Okay. But anyway, we're, we're fine. Okay. That that's. 
the most important thing. We are fine. Everything is fine for us. It, things are gonna be a little bit inconvenient, but again, we were very fortunate, so things should go back to normal relatively quickly, especially compared to um, other places of Houston. So basically, August fucking sucked! But you know what? Sometimes in life, bad shit just happens, you just gotta fucking roll with it. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna pick myself up, dust myself off, and move the fuck on, okay? Now, back to Beat League. I'm sure a lot of you are probably wondering where the hell the Kane video is, or the Orn video, Nightbringer Yasuo, SKT Syndra, the whatever the hell the Twitch skin was, the Kale skin, the Zig skin, the Four Star Guardian skin. There's a lot. <laughs> so as I mentioned before, um, the vanilla beat leak format is just stale. It's just boring as shit. I don't want to do it anymore, and I'm not gonna do it anymore. I want to make it clear. I'm not. Re I'm not talking about season three. Season three is its own beast. I have. I know what I'm doing for that. That's gonna be great. But I'm talking about these like filler episodes, if you will, where it's like you know the the new champions and new skins. The, just the vanilla beat leak format of us just playing the game and having some like barely any banter, and it's just like. This isn't even interesting. I have made this exact video, so it's the same shit, different day. Same shit, different day. That's what the Beat League series has suffered from, from a very long, for a very long time. Obviously, there are exceptions. If we have a lot of fun playing the games, or we have <laughs> really, really bad luck, I can make a normal video. I can make a good video with just our, our gameplay. But everything in between, which honestly is becoming more and more as time goes on, it's just... It's so boring and stale, and it's not interesting. I'm not doing it anymore. So, you'll also notice that, again, th th these past couple of patches, there have been... Riot has just painted uh, a target on my asshole, and they have just been... <laughs> they have just been pounding it with skins. So, I am at the point where... I'm. D you know what, Riot? <laughs> Ravage me. <laughs> just, just bring it. Bring all the skins. Bring all the champions. Go ahead. Go ahead. Just smother me. I don't care, okay? I'm gonna let them tucker themselves out, and when Riot releases a fucking patch that doesn't have a new champion or a new skin, then I will go back, I will catch up on all of them, and I will put them all in one video. This is, of course, unless I'm working on something that I would rather work on. Uh, but that, that's my current plan, okay? So I've got, like, because I have a specific idea for that, that particular video. So that should be good whenever the hell it comes out. Um, I don't really care if it's this next month, next week, next month, next year, what, I mean, <laughs> probably shouldn't say next year, because knowing Riot, <laughs> I might have jinxed myself, but <laughs> you get the point. So I will catch up, catch up with all of it in one fell swoop, one video, whenever there's a break in, in skins that I have to beat that they're releasing. And then after that, expect the, the standard beat league formula to, to change, okay? Because... Like, don't get me wrong, I'm still going to record it the exact same way. I'm still gonna get my friends together, and we're still just gonna play the game, and if, if something funny happens, you will see it, okay? You will still see the same funny moments. But, if nothing happens, which is the vast majority of the time, then I'm gonna, I'm just gonna have fun with the way I, I make those videos, okay? Uh, cause, like, Javier doesn't always do something stupid for me to make a song about him. Okay? It's just, it's like, sometimes, most of the time, nothing happens. So, don't be surprised if in the future, after the Kane and Owen and all those skins, don't be surprised if after that particular video, the episodes are significantly shorter. Because I, I don't know if I'm gonna let them pile up again. So, that, I mean, shit, you might get like one, like, minute long, two, two minutes episodes. I don't know. Um, I'm just gonna, I, again, I'm gonna just be more adventurous with it. Because at this point, the same, fu like, if I had finished the Kane video a couple weeks ago, I shit you not, it would have been the exact same thing as the Braum video. Fuck that. Now, as for as for season three in particular, like I said, I, I finished the champions on the, on the second. I've, I've more or less finished the planning as well. I'm probably gonna start editing the videos within the next couple weeks, which is fucking fantastic. Um, now, even though I said in the in the update video that December was only wishful thinking, and that realistically speaking, <laughs> it's gonna come out early next year. I still see people assuming that it is guaranteed for December. It is not, especially now that I've, I've planned out what I'm doing. 
honestly, the only way it's gonna hit by December is if one of two things happen. Either a fucking miracle happens and everything goes by incredibly smoothly, or I don't release anything for the next five months and only work on that. And something tells me <laughs> that people probably wouldn't be too happy with that second one. So let's have our fingers crossed for the first one, but honestly manage your re expectations realistically. It's probably not gonna be ready until early next year. Um, it'll be worth it, but uh, like, I'm not gonna rush it, okay? I'm not gonna rush it out f f for the fucking December revenue. Fuck that. So yeah, anyway, there was something else I wanted to talk about. Streaming. So, in the in the Beat League update video, I mentioned that I was gonna be streaming this year. That is still my plan, um, and it is one of my high priorities. But right now, my top two priorities, obviously, are season two, because I need to... I, uh, season three. <laughs> Season 3, because I need to keep that on track, obviously, because I still I would still like it to be out as quickly as possible. So I need to keep that on track and not procrastinate on that. And also getting the channel back on track in general. I don't wanna re I don't wanna, you know, take another fucking month or two to release the next video. That like believe it or not, I don't actually enjoy doing that. I I guarantee you, I am significantly more upset about me taking a month and a half to release one fucking video than any of you. Guaranteed. Hundred percent. So, I want to get my shit back on track, okay? So that's going to be my top priority, okay? Because I'm a, I'm a YouTuber first. That is what I'm going to be focusing on for the next couple of weeks. After I get my channel back on track, and as long as Season 3 is on track, then I will start streaming. I'm just letting you know right off the bat, streams are probably going to start kind of slow, like once a week. Ideally, I'd like to be able to stream like three or four times a week, but, you know, I've got a lot going on right now. So... I want to start off, I want to start off safe and just kind of ease into, you know, baby steps. I want to ease into it, you know, and then I'll see about building it up from there. So yeah, if you want more details, because I'm probably not going to, I'm probably not going to mention it again in a, in a video verbally. So if you want the, you know, to find out exactly when I'm streaming and updates and stuff like that, follow me on, on Twitter, at Trinamortal, follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Trinamortal. So follow me there. You'll, you'll, you'll know when I'm streaming. Okay, so yeah, that's about it. I didn't want to take so long to release one video, but a lot of a lot of shit happened that was just out of my control, and it just kind of snowballed, and like it's just there's nothing I could do. So at this point, I'm just trying to I'm just trying to get back on track, just move on, you know, move on. I know some people probably skip all my For Honor videos, uh, and I, I mean shit, I wouldn't blame you because truth be told, <laughs> my For Honor videos have been pretty much just chill immortals. The, like for the the entire year, so those were boring as shit. I don't blame you if you if you instinctively, reflexively skipped it. But give this give that one a shot. I did I did actually have some fun editing that video. It was one of the only videos this year that I actually enjoyed making. So take that for what it's worth. Give it a shot. You might be surprised. You might not. But hey, who knows? Hopefully, things will stop fucking up around me and. Things don't get delayed again, but I don't know. I don't know what's gonna be happening because obviously I need to get that fucking patio fixed and I, I mean, who knows what else is gonna fucking happen. So, I don't know. I'm gonna try my absolute best to make sure that nothing, nothing else fucks me up, but <laughs> you know my luck. To those of you who have been patient and supportive for the past couple of months, thank you. Honestly, thank you. That shit means a lot to me, especially when my stress levels are at an all-time high. So thank you so fucking much for for being so supportive and and like chill about things. Especially my Patreon. So the people who still support me on Patreon, fucking thank you. Like holy shit. I felt bad. Like I felt bad for, you know, obviously not releasing anything for so long. So I wrote them a post a couple a couple days ago and just they were so supportive and nice. You know, so like, honestly, again, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you. To everybody who is supportive and patient with me, thank you. Okay, you the real MVPs, okay? I'm gonna focus on getting my shit back on track. I'm gonna focus on having fun doing my job again. And once I can do that, once I can get my shit together, you're gonna have a lot more fun. So, look forward to that, okay? Um, anyway, I got a lot of shit to do today. So, I hope you guys enjoy the For Honor video. Um, and I will see you next time. Soon.